Hi, this is Ginger from My Sister Scrapper. Today I have a project to share with you that I created as a Butterbee Scraps Artistic Treasures Design Team project. The paper collection that I used um, is this uh, paper called Bell something. I can't pronounce it. Anyway, um, there are six by six papers and it's actually mixed media paper, which I didn't realize, but it's from Indigo Blue. So what I did is I used a Graphic 45 regular size tag album and decorated the pages and then I made a little box to put it in. And on the box I used the design paper here. Um, this paper has like a really shiny finish on it so I used the Tim Holtz Distress Stain in Walnut Stain and went around the edges. So that worked out really, really well. Um, so I have uh, one of her butterflies here. I have a Petaloo flower here and another coffee dyed flower underneath that and I layered on some more of the metal pieces here and then there is the sides this paper is amazing and then on the back I used one of um, her wooden embellishments that says handmade I love the little car right there so that's the little box and I did decorate the inside just to give it a little more stability so it's like this I tagged some um, May Arts silk ribbon at the top here and again this is the graphic 45 regular size black staples tag album so on the first tag I used one of the corner pieces here and I used a couple of the gears and the clock hands this little wooden embellishment is actually one that I had on my stash and then this pretty little filigree here I put in the middle and then I fussy cut one of the little roses off from the paper and added that on the inside and then on the back of this one, um, I kept it pretty plain because I like the little chair and I added just some little black bling here to the crown. And on the second tag, again another butterfly here. I laid it on top of a butterfly that was actually printed on the design paper. I have a filigree back here. I have a couple more coffee dyed flowers and I have another metal piece here in the middle. And then these are the angel wings and I added those to the back. Kind of steampunky looking. And then on the back of this one, I love the bird here on the paper, so I just added a corner piece to this side right here. And on the next tag, I added a key from Butterbee Scraps, obviously, and then another uh, metal flower here, another petaloo flower, and two little uh, brown flowers, roses that I had in my stash, and I'm not sure where I got those. I've had them for quite a while. And then I love this cute little bead. This is, again, part of Butterbee Scraps and another little mini gear right here that I added to the front of the clock. And on the back, I made this a little photo mat and I did leave this open. I have a metal uh, filigree here that I just cut in half and layered it with a black doily and put a little photo mat there. And on this one, again, I have a large butterfly here. I love the Eiffel Tower paper here and I added another metal piece and another wooden piece that I had in my stash. And on the back of this one, I lift, lift, lift this one plain. I love the little uh, spool of thread here with the wings on it and a nice um, little megaphone here. And over here I have a little uh, picture frame that I had in my stash. Another one of the Butterbee scraps metal pieces here and I added a black bling to the center. This is another one of her metal flowers here and I layered it on a little crochet doily and then I put one of those brown roses in the center of this flower right here. And on the back I love this paper plane here. I love the chandelier on it. And on the last tag, I went ahead and layered some of the gears, the mini gears and the regular gears, on the clock face here. And then I added one of these um, little drawer pulls. And on the last one on the back, I um, layered one of the metal hearts here. And I had a little heart frame that I put on, layered on top of that. And this is that same metal, uh, excuse me, wood embellishment that I had on the back of the box. And I just flipped it over and then added another metal piece on top of that. So that's my little tag album using the Graphic 45 regular size black tag album and then I made the box myself and then I used this uh, mixed media paper from Indigo Blue called Bell something because I have no clue how to pronounce that. <laughs> so there you go everybody. That's my project for Better Be Scraps Artistic Treasures. There you have it. Thanks for watching. Bye.